we were true. Be boy, rule boy. They say that from the heart, rock, rule. We cruise on fours, rules them doors. Do they hold the laws? They don't play jewels. Fat babies in the step in our shoes. Off square rule, climb all over rules. Red stereo store, off fuel. Jet in the chase them you. They cost so few. They don't know what they do when we come true. Be boy, rude boy. Be boy, rule boy. We destroy them, get up toys. They don't understand what we come for. Be boy, rude boy. Be boy, rule boy. We destroy them, get up toys. They don't understand what we come for. Be boy, rude boy. Star shapes, rest yeah. under dream states, populations don't date, burn your fortune, magazine fame, not the side you claim, you're just a no name, fuck this rap game, I'm near checkout, write you a checkout for rappers to shut their mouth, these boys are bad, probably signed with Diddy, you got five shots, turn whack like you collab with 50, skill levels iffy, Mac Miller monotone, hard to the bone, doubt Bone marrow's consumed Hip-hop is dust Good, I brought a broom I'm so dope, me too There's not enough room Stashing a grub, 
Dressed like a squirrel, live in the bubble in oblivion. The tea party made it a shack of wedding. Don't take my crumb, but don't text my muffin. They're trying to make me have teeth for something. Stay out of my swamp, away from my dirt. Don't want no aid on my property. Don't own no house, barely a car. The rationale, human liberty, the man in the trash. Wears a gas mask, always prepping for the end of the world. Reactionary ways, a steroid pace, stashing up nuts like a squirrel. There's a place called Khan, a home for a fox. He doesn't use a gun, but he hurts a lot and pays you by the day. You work and you die. Forms make you stay, buying apples of his eye. There's a place called Khan, a home for a fox. He doesn't use a gun, but he hurts a lot and pays you by the day. You work and you die. Forms make you stay, buying apples of his eye. Ladies and gentlemen, thanks for tuning in to the New Word Document radio show. This is our first show, and I feel especially bad that I can't be here today, but I'm visiting my ma's for Minnesota. Hi, Mom. I love you, Mom. I hope you all understand. But uh, my friend here, Troutsky, co-host, producer all around Casanova is going to be taking care of you sweetly tonight just like he took care of this beat I'm laying this over so I'll see you next week and until then enjoy the guest host Bro Bro enjoy Trotsky what's up everybody and good evening Milwaukee this is Trotsky with the new word document radio program uh, very first show every friday 9 to 10 p.m uh my co-host smasher could not be in the studio tonight so i have a guest co-host with me johnny clayton what's up everybody uh he's known as bro bro on the streets that's um, right and a little bit later, you you heard him in the first track called Alicia. After that was our call-in guest, Spade One, who is uh, playing tonight. Uh, somewhere in Milwaukee, I forgot the club name. We'll have to ask him that when he calls in. Yeah. Um, and then I also, I have Gretchen Maycorn and Liz Getchow with the World Stage Theater Company. Yeah. Hey and they will be here throughout the show. Um, first off, we'll... Uh, Let's uh, introduce Bro Bro to you, Johnny Clayton. Which did you prefer on it on the air? Uh, you know, both work, but, uh, you know, Johnny's been my name for uh, about 22 years now. You know what I'm saying? I, I know what you're saying. Yeah. Yeah. So, Johnny. Okay, yeah. Bro Bro. Um, <laughs> and uh, Gretchen, uh, you have a production going on right now. Yeah, um, hi, I'm Gretchen Mayford. I'm the artistic director at the World Stage Theatre Company, and I'm here with uh, Liz Gutchow, who is a cast member in the production called Desire is Death, Sonnet 147, and we are going to be opening uh, June 10th through 13th. And uh, Colin is not a stranger to our company. No, I'm not. Although I thought I was, I guess, up until now. <laughs> mm. Sort of was. Yeah, he uh, did some of the sound design and music for our last production, The Unseen, that we did in January over at the 10th Street Theater. Yes, it was a very good show, I might add. Despite the music in the beginning. <laughs> because of the music. It helped, I think. But, uh... Yeah, that was a good show. So what? the next one's a Shakespeare then, huh? Yeah, uh, we're doing uh, it at the uh, Villa Terrace Decorative Arts Museum on the lakefront, mm -hmm. so it's a gorgeous space to be uh, set in. Um, the show is called, as I said, Desire's Death, Sonnet 147. Um, it's an exploration of love and loss through the language of William Shakespeare. So it's going to be a bunch of uh, scenes and sonnets that all look at uh, the complicated mess of human relationships. Okay. That sounds deep. And then uh, that's directed by Mara McGee. Yes, Mara, Mag Mara Mag McGee is our director for the production, and we have about 14 people in the cast, so a fairly oh, large yeah, cast. Yeah, that's yeah. Um, well, I was going to say we're right in the beginning of the whole rehearsal process, and Mara is very good at 
with organic directing. So mm. it's going to be interesting to see how this all turns out. We have about two and a half weeks of rehearsal and an all-star cast, so I think it's going to come together really well. All right. Um, I was supposed to ask you about this artist night. Uh, can you give me more about that since oh, I'm so confused sure. and remembering it? Definitely, yeah. Tickets for the show are... Uh, $10 for students and seniors and $12 for adults. And again, the show dates are Sunday, June 10th through Wednesday, June 13th. All performances are at 7.30 p.m. Um, and you can call for tickets at uh, the Villa Terrace Art Museum at 414-278-8295. And then also the artist night on Tuesday, June 12th, we are doing this thing, inviting visual artists to come in and they can come and sketch uh, the show and uh, be part of the creative process for uh, $5 only. Great. That sounds good. That sounds real cool. Yeah. Yeah, we're definitely all about inter-arts collaboration and we really want to uh, broaden our audience demographic to the visual arts scene and we're really excited to hopefully inspire arts through our art. Yeah. Um, tell, tell in case people know, tell us more about the Villa Terrace Museum. Oh yeah, sure. It's just uh, is that part of the like Charles Alice? Yeah, it's in conjunction with the Char yeah. Charles Alice Art Museum. Um, it's uh, the beautiful, uh, gorgeous kind of Italian style European villa that's on the lakefront. Um, they have beautiful gardens, uh, an event ballroom, uh, a courtyard, and so we're definitely going to be utilizing a lot of the spaces. It's okay. a beautiful, beautiful space to uh, be able to perform in. Oh, it sounds great. Yeah. Um, I think right now uh, we got Spade One calling in in approximately five to ten minutes. So I think what we'll do is we'll transit transition over to another Spade One song, and this one's called The uh, Lucky Number. Lyrically pleasing is the reason No matter the season We freeze them, we heat them Meet them and greet them Reach them and teach them Eat them and freak them Tease them and see them Meet them, delete them Verbally mistreat them Take a heed them Release the demons to freedom We defeat them with every word that we speak on We defeat them with every word that we speak on One 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 the reason, lyrically pleasing is the reason No matter the season, we freeze them, we heat them Meet them and greet them, reach them and teach them Eat them and freak them, tease them and see them Beat them, delete them, verbally mistreat them Take a heed and release the demons of freedom We defeat them with every word that we speak on We defeat them with every word that we speak on One 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 sound board in the area, beats are bound in the area. This is how we get down, see, we're gonna twitch it up, man. We're gonna get on some party stage, you know? One. Put these drinks up. Speak it, you find it's a big one with two. Second blows, last breast blows. I want them hands in the man, and I'm with two. Do what you do, it's up to me. Buy another round, it's a big pound. Put the bit put around. We put the hands up in your town. As we rev up the crowd, I'm drunk right now. Me sipping old style. TV out, superstar with them heads in the cloud. Smoking on that loud, seeing spot the cow. Milwaukee best in the house. One. One. I am the lucky number. One. Number. 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 Number.
party straight jumping, be pumping and puffing, grinding and puffing, get on the floor, till you get sore, I'm so drunk, I think I ran off four, I'll turn to give me one more, as the drink is poor, let the inner bitches sore, fill up a course, go on a four, 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 here to party, that's what I be here for, living a high life, I'm a vet, keep my red stripe, the four pack king, always stay ice, I say that four pack king, always stay ice, one, one, shortly into the radio show it's refreshing to hear some dance hall you know we need more dance hall yeah. artists you know yeah and that shit's heavy real heavy yeah, i dig right it. up in your ears right up in the ears uh on the same topic of music i was wondering you have a 10 song is that a demo or is that an yeah album? something like that you know i call it a demo uh, uh, but yeah it's a 10 song demo album yeah. just kind of give you know people an idea of you know the what style and all that yeah yeah, I think, think the one thing it's missing that track inside your speakers. That's right. We did. We did yeah, do that. that. You. Yeah, that's. For those who don't know, which I'd be shocked, Colin is a kick-ass producer, beat maker. All right, enough of that. You know what no I'm commercialism saying? commercialism allowed. Well, hey, yeah. just keeping it real. You but, know, he uh, hooked yeah. me up numerous times with some pretty sweet tracks. Um. Sure. Uh, you know what? I think we're going to put you on the spot. And oh, uh, we're going to play another track by Johnny Clayton called When I Wake Up. Right on. And uh, what's this song about? It's about waking uh, up? Yeah, basically, you from know. From sleeping, like a full night's sleep or a nap? Or uh, I would say sleeping. Drunk and pass out. And that too, you know. Whatever. Just, uh, you know, another state of mind. It's all about, you know. Is it kind of like while you're dreaming, mind. while you're still up? Right, you know. You know, where like, you just can't get yeah, up? Well, you know, it, and it kind of is about, like, you know, how they say life is a dream, you know? Okay. All that kind of, all that jazz. All right, well, uh, this is When I Wake Up from Johnny Clayton, as we love to call him, Bro Bro. That's right. I'm 
waking up It's too good of a dream, you know I like the way it feels And I like the way it seems I'm gonna sit back and just let the green Grass grow all around me And when I wake up And when I wake up for your six-foot deranged tantrum waves and house-high installations, room-sized drifts, and winds, constant hydraulic instructions. Part bison, I lower my head face directly into a stalled bus filled with snow, a man blown into the lake forever. Karoom, kaboom, me, blown balloon-like into abandoned cars, silent prayers. Always too quickly, it's James Joyce's birthday and snowblowers, loud erasing of drifts, shadows, leaving the storm a great puzzlement, like the loneliness, poems house in oak. And thank you to Blizzard for such deep, deep, deep snow sleep. Okay, and you're back uh, here with New Word Document on riverwestradio.com. Yeah, that yeah. was uh, Suzanne Firer and Jim Hazard, who apparently has recently passed away. Rest in peace. Uh, we're waiting for our call now from Spade One. I just got a text from him. He said he's about to call in. Uh, we'll see. I don't really know the equipment as well yet. We'll see how this all goes down. Um, Give it see. a shot, Spade. Why don't you guys plug this uh, this play one more time? Sure. Hi. Um, yeah, the world stage. We're doing uh, Desire is Death, Sonnet 147, at the Villa Terrace Decorative Arts Museum, June 10th through the 13th. All performances at 7.30 p.m. Uh, tickets can be purchased by calling 414-278-8295. And the show is about an exploration of love and loss through the language of William Shakespeare. We are really excited to do this production. Um, on Tuesday night, June 12th, visual artists uh, get to come in for $5 and sketch the villa, sketch the actors, and just be able to create in their art form through our art form of theater. So we hope to see you there. That should be really good. I do intend on going myself. Me as well. Uh, last play I've seen, The Unseen, by uh, this same company, the World Stage Theater Company, was fantastic. Well, thank you. Just thank three you. actors. And blood, I remember. Called. Yeah, person drama, pretty intense. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I was actually uh, reading, rereading 1984, so... It, yeah, uh, similar themes, definitely. Very much, similar yeah. Similar themes, for sure, for yep. sure. And yeah, I felt that, especially the... Uh, the it was what's the Smetana? What's the, what's the name of the guard? The guard. Smash. 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 Yes. Yes. Is that who Clayton Hamburg played? That yes, definitely. That's who Clayton Hamburg played. Reminds me of the uh, O'Brien or whatever his name is. The end of 1984. 
Definitely, because well, they both deal with like these totalitarian societies yeah. and and the torture like for no purpose. Right, and uh, why we're here and why they're in prison and in that world. So, yes. Well, I'm not uh, getting this call yet from uh, Spade One, so I'm going to assume that something's up with that. So uh, we'll continue. We'll play one more song here, and this one's called Archived Sexting, uh, which is by Diameter Correlator. Uh, vocals on this are from my, who will be my normal co-host, Smasher. Um, I hope you enjoy this little punk rock for you.
my name is Trotsky. This is our very first episode. Uh, in the studio tonight, we have Johnny Clayton, the vocalist. Yes, sir. And we also have Gretchen Maycorn and Liz Getchow of the World Stage Theater Company. And uh, I'm actually want to get back to talking about the uh, in relation to the show. I was just uh, curious. Um, what? Uh, how can you explain the relevance to doing Shakespeare today? I guess oh, that's a lot of people don't. I guess don't really understand the. Uh, you know. Why we're doing something that was written for, like over 400 years ago yeah. today, basically, and yeah. supposedly stuffy language. Um, well, I think, unfortunately, a lot of people have been exposed to, you know, Shakespeare and, you know, people in gowns and Renaissance garb. But really, when you really look into the language, and I'll uh, let Liz talk about this, too, there's some really intense, heightened, raw emotions. Mm -hmm. Like, in this show in particular, it's all about Madness. human relationships, you know, love, rage, people killing their lovers, mm -hmm. people, you know, giving up their lives for another person. I mean, it's really intense, emotional, raw stuff with this beautiful language mm -hmm. um, to work with. Yeah. Because in fact, this show, at the beginning, it starts out pretty lighthearted, and you know, you think of love the way that you always do, you know, desire, lust, all that. And by the second half, you're in the other side of the raw emotions, you know, anger, jealousy, all that. In fact, in rehearsal the other day, Mara, the director, brought up the 12 emotional worlds, which I thought was a really cool concept. You kind of pick... In particular, when we were working on our sonnet, she asked, all right, what emotions do you think that these convey? So it was very interesting going and looking at the first, you know, each of us had a monologue from the first half and then a monologue from the second half. So it was very interesting to look and see the huge difference in emotions and, and pick from those emotional worlds. And Gretchen, yeah. do you remember any of those emotional worlds? Oh, there were desire, lust, anger, confusion, shame, jealous, jealousy, jealousy. That one? yeah, pain. I mean, it's the whole spectrum of human emotions and and really centering around love and desire. Desire is death. <laughs> yeah. Okay. I mean, and when you come to those emotions, they're all timeless for. Everyone. I was just so, about to say that. Yeah. Totally timeless. Yeah, and I, I think, like, yeah, I guess what it sounds like you said is just like a, a primal element to the Shakespeare that yeah. translates to human nature. Yeah, it's, it's a heightened, primitive um, language that really looks at the emotions of of us as human beings. Mm -hmm. And I think that's why it's still um, you know, relevant today is because we all experience love and we all experience jealousy and hate and desire and... Sometimes all in the same day. Yeah, sometimes yeah, all in the right. same day. And I think that really can speak to us and really can um, you know, convey emotion. Well, that's interesting. That makes sense kind of to the idea of like uh, you're saying Shakespeare done wrong or done kind of... Uh, over the top, mm -hmm. um, that kind of the idea of it being more primal kind of shows how ridiculous it is. Because when we look at Shakespeare, we think of like rich people dressing up to go to a play <laughs> yeah, and spend course. a lot of money. And no, that is not what this production is about. This production is definitely about getting to the raw emotions of the core of the text. So, yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's about all I got. Um, I actually got Spade one on the phone here, and I'm going to answer Yay. this. Spade, what's up? Hey, what's up? This uh, I'm gonna put you on speakerphone and see if I can get a little interview going this way. Just give me one moment here. Just making it work, ladies and gentlemen. Where you, you know at? What I'm you you here? Yep, yep. I hear you, sir. All right, we're hearing you too. So uh, tell us about this show you got going on tonight. Uh, tonight, man, this is waiting a while. Poker, damn, I'm gonna be on. Um, Doing some stuff with these guys called um, DFA and Gigantor, and my man Playboy DJ. You know what I'm saying? Over there yeah. on the south side tonight. You know, we're gonna be doing some dubstep and things. You know? Hell yeah, some heavy shit, huh? Uh oh. Oh yeah, some womp womp. Bang and yeah. All right, well then, where's that located? Um, I think it's three thousand south. Thirteenth. Yeah, 13th Street, yeah. 13th Street, yeah, yeah. Cool. Um, yeah, we played uh, two of your tracks tonight. Sorry we're not going to be able to work out the live uh, 
performance, freestyle type thing, but we'll definitely get you in next week. Hopefully we can get you right here in the studio. That's the ideal. Oh, yeah. yeah, yeah, man. I, I, love, I love to come down to the studio and stuff, man, but tonight was just one of those nights I yeah. had double duty, so yep, I'm, you're... I'm doing security at the Miramar and then going out to perform, too, so yeah. it's going to be a wild night tonight. Well, thanks for uh, calling in, and uh, we'll, we'll see you. We'll hear you soon here on the air. Uh, and uh, good luck with your show tonight. I'll try to make it out there. For sure, for sure. Come through, man, because um, we'll, we'll be going on like around 1 o'clock in the morning. So okay. we're going to end off the show. You know, yeah. We're going to end off the show tonight like that, you know? All right. Yeah, closing it out. Oh, yeah, for sure. We're going to shut it down, son. Yeah. All <laughs> right. All right. You have a good night, Spade One. All right, man. Everybody out there, enjoy that music. Share it if you like, you know? And yeah, and Spade I think... One, yeah. Hell yeah, and we're going to play that first song we played. Yeah, we need to run that one again. Yeah, and that was, uh, that's the uh, the B-Boy, Rube Boy track with, uh, I know I'm going to pronounce the name wrong, but it's like, Te Yamo Denku. Sounds fat. You know, yeah. It's a fat track. And... Them get fit the hard with no regard. Them get high before they find time. We 
Hawaii to do what we desire. Mag my hot fire, spit time fire, shut up the line and them town fire. Them don't wanna try us, them can't deny us. They know that we be rule of rule, boy, the bit of fire. Keep it bumping, boy, that's it, that be that what? Don't know how to say that what? The be the rule boy stop. B-boy, rule boy. B-boy, rule boy. B-boy, rule boy. And we can't talk. Okay, you're back listening to New Word Document. Word. I'm your host, Troutsky, with my guest co-host, Johnny, Johnny Clayton, Clayton, everybody. We're gonna, in the show, you gotta be bro, bro. Bro, bro. Because we all go by ridiculous <laughs> pseudonyms and That's such. right. Um, I want a pseudonym. <laughs> okay, well, you will be back next week. Or we are going to prepare a segment for uh, next week, so maybe you'll have your uh, new and improved... <laughs> Uh, why don't you tell us what you plan on uh, giving us for next week? Well, I don't want to give too much away because I want to keep the intrigue, but we'll be back giving some uh, a sneak peek of some scenes and possibly some sonnets uh, next week from same time, same place. Tune yes, in. That will be Friday, our- 9 to 10 to me. on riverwestradio.com. Uh, sonnets. Yeah, scenes and, and scenes. sonnets, and yeah. it'll be really fun. Oh, raw so. emotion. Raw sonnets emotion. Primitive raw emotion. Raw emotion. We'll Hatred be... and sex and stuff. Yeah, you know, who a sexy, love sleek that? little show. I mean, who can, doesn't love that? Sex sells. No. Sure, sure does. does. <laughs> and what do you got going on? You gonna go back in the studio, Johnny? Uh, you know, maybe. Uh, we're gonna get that track done, though, that inside your We're gonna speakers. get a few more tracks done. Because I gotta, I think we got to work on that. Yeah, you know, it's summertime. You know, get mm-hmm. out there and, and, and bump some stuff and, you know, have a good time. Have a good time. That's have a great time. Um, yeah, I'll give you one more song as we go off. Uh, this is actually myself, yours truly, Kilgore Trout. Yes, and sir. And this song is called Knowledge of the Mouse Killed the Mood. Thank you for listening and tune in again next week, 9 to 10, New Word Document, hosted by Troutsky and Smasher. Peace and love, you guys. Strange crew, definitely the other rhythmic anatomy. Strange crew, bless the beat from another musical gallery. Strange crew, definitely. The rhythmic anatomy, strange crew, bless the beat from another musical galaxy. One, two, no, three. Once there was once, and then one said one, once for every ounce the MO bounce to the trounce. You gotta catch that mouse with two traps, snapping rodents next, keeping all rats in check with decks. The different specs fly sex in an ultra acid placid vastness. Run the crashes that take advantage to plants and hammocks, wearing smocks with extra swan added for gym socks, dreadlocks. The pass a chance, the king size mattress can only fasten with the quickest action. Tasted like satisfaction, but can't get none even with a little passion. Strange crew, definitely the other rhythmic anatomy. Strange crew, bless the beat from another musical gallery. Strange crew, definitely the other rhythmic anatomy. Strange crew, bless the beat from another musical galaxy. Cannabis ejaculation causes pseudopregy abdomens Begging for the blood of children Flattering batteries leaving Saturn keys around different galaxies His majesty, no less magically Grasp the pond clocks tragically Praying for time to pray a little less gradually And then he has to be placed sarcastically Actually outside any reality Not a beat time, me around for the others No familiar bloodline, but just still my brother's universal family me and she, she ain't no mystery. One, two, no mystery. Strange crew, definitely the other rhythmic anatomy. Strange crew, bless the beat from another musical gallery. Strange crew, definitely the other rhythmic anatomy. Strange crew, bless the beat from another musical galaxy.